In my previous video on the Greater Southern Waterfront series, I mentioned about the immense potential of District 3 and 5. To recap, if you study the transaction volumes of new home sales over the first nine months of 2019, you would notice that District 3 and 5 are among the top three best-selling districts for new launches. In fact, when you study the transaction value, District 3 tops the chart with more than 2.1 billion and District 5 ranks third with more than 1.4 billion. This reflects the confidence and the demand that the market is placing on these two neighboring districts. So in this video, let's examine the driving force behind the demand in District 5. You know, speaking of District 5, it's actually much bigger and more exciting than many of our first impressions are. You know, it stretches from Clemente area, which by the way, is next to the Jurong Lake district that has evolved into the second CBD after the decentralization efforts in the previous master plans. District 5 is also right next to District 10 and the exciting District 3. One North is also located in District 5. It is a vibrant research and business park that serves as a fertile ground for research and innovation. This enormous 200 hectares development houses key growth sectors such as biomedical science, info communications technology, and media and startups, supported by the capabilities in science and engineering. And then we have the Dover Knowledge District in District 5 that serves as the extension to One North. It realizes the synergies between nearby business parks, academic and research institutions. It will offer vibrant integrated spaces to create exciting new jobs and learning opportunities and support Singapore's long-term economic growth. And as we move closer to Pasir Panjang, we have Maple Tree Business Cities 1 and 2 that house some of the world's renowned tech giants such as Google, Cisco, Wirecard and more. So ladies and gentlemen, investment properties require a huge pool of quality tenants and District 5 offers exactly just that. District 5 also forms part of the Greater Southern Waterfront, which is itself six times the size of Marina Bay. It is amazingly large scale infrastructure transformation that is unprecedented in modern Singapore's history. I have actually shot a video that highlights the many sectors of the Greater Southern Waterfront. Please visit my website singaporegreatersouthernwaterfront.com for more details. By now, with its close proximity to the CBD and Prime District 10, you realize that District 5 offers an ideal option for homeowners who want to enjoy excellence, convenience and growth potential without having to pay the premium for Prime District 10 properties. Now, another interesting fact actually comes from the HDB resale figures. You know, it is very rare that HDB prices cross the $1 million mark. However, you would notice that a large number of non-DBSS HDB $1 million transaction come from districts 3 and 5, namely Tiong Bahru, Queenstown and Clemente. Ladies and gentlemen, what I've presented to you are cold hard facts and figures. If you still harbor the thought that prices are still high now, you know, be prepared for more jaw-dropping figures a few more years down the road. District 5 and 3 present a dynamic combination of opportunities that even the prime districts may not offer. Now, you have the opportunity to ride on the wave of massive transformation. You know, interestingly, it also offers affordable city living near Orchard Road and CBD without requiring you to pay that extra premium, at least for now. In fact, you even have the option of choosing between skyscrapers with breathtaking views or low-rise tranquil living near nature and parks for your next property investment. Ladies and gentlemen, if what I've presented so far resonates with you, please drop me a message at 96971131. My name is PK So and I look forward to furnishing you with more detailed summary of the choices available to embark on this journey with me. You may also want to visit SingaporeGreaterSouthernWaterfront.com for more information.
Remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel and check out my other videos before your next property purchase. So with that, thank you very much and I look very much forward to seeing you soon.